Yo, be quiet. <laughs> be quiet. I'm recording. All right, turn the game off. <laughs> God, no. Hi, I'm Chester Beam from Reason to Win, and I'm glad that you joined us today. I want to talk about how the past and the future can harm your now. The past, if it's good or bad, they are equally harmful to you if they use the wrong way. If they are bad, it can bring bitterness into your life. If it's good, it makes you want to be complacent and just stay in that moment. Then you won't be prepared for what God has for you. And then the future, people stare at the future and don't uh, and want this and have a vision and everything and don't take care of now. So if I have the future and I'm not ready for it, because God puts systems in place. If I'm not ready for this, it's different steps. If I'm not ready for what he has for in the future, my future probably won't happen. So today I want you to really look at yourself and say, hey, am I ready for the future? Am I focusing on our past or I'm focusing on it now? In Genesis, you notice that God put the future in his creation. The animals, the plants, they all had seeds in them for their future. Now, what I'm trying to say is that God put a seed in you. Uh, a vision, uh, hopes, dreams, or talents, gifts. God put a seed in you, you have to take care of it. That means your future is now. It's not ahead of you, it's not behind you, it is now. Because the gifts and visions you have is already in you. God do not create anything that he has not finished. So I just want y'all to take that and think about that and really have your faith in God that he has your best interests in heart. And he have a place for you and only you. Thank you. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And hit that notification bell. Slap that button.